Hi, this is something really rare. It's the Jaw Doucette on the Brazilian Jaw uh, Joys card. So I got this around 20, maybe 14, 15. So yeah, it's a really nice piece. Uh, these were released in Brazil in 1988. So they're slightly later than most vintage, but they're still considered vintage. And, you know, uh, these Brazilian card, obviously the Vlix is worth the most. But any of these figures is really tough to find. The R2, you, you often see the R2, but all the others are really difficult. And I've heard that uh, Thal Jabren is quite rare as well, very rare. So, really nice piece. You can see the figure there. He's different to the Kenner release. So this is the Mech Brazilian version. Comes with the same weapon that Four Alarm Zuckers came with. But it's a really nice piece. The cards are kind of oversized. The bl blisters on the other side to where the Kenner cards had it. But, you know, it's a really nice generic painted card. I've got the glass lighty symbol there. R2 and C3PO, Boba Fett, Vlix, who's the most highly sought. Glass IT figure, you've got Jewel Doucette there, and you've got Vlix and uh, Tig From there. But a beautiful piece. I mean, I've got a video of this up, but I never, I don't feel I talked when I reviewed it, I just sort of filmed it and I didn't do a very good job on it. But here's the back of the card. So it says Star Wars Droids Adventures of R2D2 and c 3 This will be in Portuguese. So if you can read Portuguese, that's great for you. There's C3PO R2D2. I've got the R2D2. There's Dal Joben. Uh, Jewel Dusat. Kezaban. I think there's one on eBay at the moment, a Kezaban. Brazilian card. I think there's one in the UK, one in the US. The US version is cheaper. There's the... I mean, both are Brazilian glass lighty. There's the Vlix, the most highly sought figure. And Kia Mole. They did vehicles as well. They did the ATL Interceptor and the Imperial Side Gunner. Glasslight Industria, the Plasticals, Brazil, Glasslighty. 1988, definitely. They did a line of the, the more regular Kenner figures as well. And they're the Brazilian Power of the Force figures. But this is such a nice item. Beautiful, really. I mean, you don't see these often. And I got this for a great price compared to what they go for now. I think I paid about 250 in sterling. Or as great British pounds, as Action Figure Grader would say. But still a beautiful piece. I mean, the card's in relatively great condition. Jewel Doucette. So they just put a sticker above the figure. The cards are generic though, so all figures got this card. Good look at the figure there. This is truly a rare piece. And looks great. I love foreign cards. I love oddities and this just fits the bill. I think I got it from a seller in the UK. I'm pretty sure I did. And uh, I pounced on it at the right time just before prices just went bonkers. Because now something like this would go for around, well, it certainly would cost a pretty penny. I mean, the R2 I've got, it's got a crease along the here. The card is glossy on this side and kind of dry and matte on this side. But a beautiful piece, this. Lovely. So, Droid Jewel Doucette. Brilliant. That looks like it's just a bit of a bubble imperfection there. Is there denting there? No, it's just the same on that side as well. But brilliant piece. Looks, displays really well. 
Let's jaw do set. Oh, there's a bit of a crease there actually. Just caught it in the light. But, you know, these things are so hard to find. It's just such a nice item. So he's got his very purple tunic, red undershirt, red belt, grey slacks, red boots. And yeah, he's got this funny little hairstyle. But a great piece, this. This is a highly treasured item. And, you know, with the new vintage collection droids, they did three figures. They did the Boba Fett, the 3PO and R2. But... This is the real deal. I mean, the colours on the card are quite vibrant on the front side. Just really pops. It's nice to have such an oddity. I know everyone wants licks, but beggars cannot be choosers. Kia Mole. Thal Jobren. This is Thal Jobren. I've heard he's really rare. I mean, I think he comes with a black blaster, but you wouldn't want to swap these blasters for the Luke Stormtrooper because these are made in Brazil. But a beautiful piece, isn't it? Looks so good. Don't want it toppling off the thing so I can get a better shot. Beautiful figure and card. It just looks amazing. Hope you like looking at that. That's Jaw Doucette on the Brazilian Droids card. Cheers. Goodbye.